Hi guys, welcome back to Grace's room and welcome back to another Hawaii vlog. So today I'm up early because I'm doing the Diamond Head Crater hike, which is um, this hike around an old volcano. And um, it's recommended that you get up early to do it because otherwise it gets really hot. So yeah, it's like around eight o'clock or something like that. And I'm a little bit tired. I'm not very good at hikes and stuff like that. So not sure how I'm gonna go but I think it takes about like um half an hour to walk around there 45 minutes maybe so we'll see how we go <laughs> So it's only been like what, five minutes into the walk and I'm already feeling like I could go to sleep and I'm also really hungry. And this, um, this trail is like going uphill as well. So yeah, it's a lot of work. ground is not even so it's just making this walk like 10 times harder I'm so tired I actually look like a mess right now because we just went up like a bunch of stairs and I'm so tired like I actually want to fall asleep I'm making everyone sit down with me right now because I need a break I'm very unfit <laughs> go James oh my gosh So we made it to the top of Diamond Head. Um, I am so tired, it was a big walk, but it was totally worth it because I mean the view is really beautiful. So our hotel is like all the way over there and we have two options. We can either walk back or we can get an Uber and we are definitely getting an Uber, I am so tired. So this is actually the crater of like the old volcano and I can't believe how big it is, it's massive. <laughs> now we have to walk back down and I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it. I thought it would be a lot easier going downhill but still feels like a bit of, a, bit of work. made it oh I'm so happy that's done um, it was a good walk but um it's really hot and I need food in my stomach so we quickly just stopped at a cafe on the way home um, and I got a pineapple juice because I am so thirsty and I need something refreshing but I think I'm gonna get something to eat for breakfast back near the hotel that is so refreshing Okay, so we're back near the hotel now and we just went to a cafe and I got a lemon and sugar crepe. It is, looks really nice. I've had it before, it's really nice. I love crepes. I know we can get them at home, but they're still really good. Mm, yummy. But anyway, I'm definitely feeling a lot more full now and a lot more energetic So I think we might go back to the hotel and maybe go for a quick swim at the beach Just walking to the beach now and I feel like I've definitely recovered from the hike If you guys couldn't really tell, hikes are not really my thing I definitely um, much rather enjoy a nice peaceful walk rather than all that exercise <laughs> If I'm being totally honest um, but yeah, just gonna go for a quick swim now. I have arrived at the water and I'm about to walk in. Um, the water has touched my feet and it's feeling a little cold so I'm probably gonna have to get used to the water. Okay, I'm better now. All right, I'm good. It's nice, the water, actually. Now that I'm used to it. 
waves don't look too strong, so maybe I can lower out a bit further. James and I were at the beach, we did this competition where basically we came out kind of far and we had to see if we could make it um, back to shore first. And basically like we're not allowed to move, we're not allowed to paddle or anything, we're just gonna let the waves take us. And um, we did two rounds the other day, oh, big wave, big wave. We did two rounds the other day and I won one, James won one, won one. <laughs> so basically this is the decided round today. James and I are gonna see who can make it back to shore first and whoever wins. Um, I, I don't know something. <laughs> anyway, so we have to sit on our floating first, and hopefully I win. for a little bit um, and then we'll probably just go back to the room. So I just got out of the shower and mum brought up this really nice sandwich. Um, it looks really big but like I'm actually craving something a little bit healthier so I thought I'd have some. Mm. Really good but it's so big. haven't done before is check out the state's biggest flea market which is at the Aloha Stadium so we thought that we'd go there to check it out see if maybe we can get some little souvenirs or something so we're here at the stadium now and you can actually see it's over there it's really cool um, but basically all around the stadium they have a bunch of like little stalls and stuff so it probably takes like over two hours to get around there so probably not gonna be able to make it to every single stall but we're gonna have a little walk around and see what we can find there. or something like that for the beach so they wear a dress. It's kind of cute. I think I might get this really cute anklet. I think I'll make a really cute gift. It's really humid around here and we would get something refreshing. So we've got this pineapple juice. Um, we're sharing it with the family, don't worry. This is not just for me. <laughs> but it looks so cool. I'd like to try it. Mm, that's really good. That's really nice. The pineapple is so good here. Mm -hmm. Yummy. I just got some saltwater taffy in this Hawaiian punch flavor. I'm actually so interested to try it. I want to try one now, actually. It's kind of melted, though. Mm. Even though it's melted, it tastes pretty good. 
we had almost made it around the entire stadium, but the weather's being really annoying at the moment with the rain, so I think we're just gonna go back now near the hotel. But I did circle back to one of the stands and I got this um, butterfly hair clip. I love hair clips at the moment, and I love butterflies, so I thought that this was so cute. So we're back at the International Marketplace and there's this one cafe that we always go to um, in the afternoon. It's so good, it's called Corona Coffee and they just have like the best like treats and coffee. So we love coming here. I'm gonna get something now. This is probably like my 10th snack of the day but I've got this really um, nice pastry here. I've like had it every single day and I've got a little iced latte as well but this is so good. It's got like an apple in the middle. It's like puff pastry. It's so good. This place gets really busy. It's very popular, so I've always got to fight to make sure I get pastry, otherwise it sells out. So we're just having a little walk around the international marketplace and I really need a pair of like summery white shoes that are probably not like heels or anything, just something comfortable. And I've seen a lot of people wearing Birkenstocks at the moment so I thought maybe I'd try and get a nice pair for myself. So I'll see if any stores around here sell them. So I found these ones and they're really cute and they're very comfortable as yeah. well actually. These ones are really better for my feet, but I kind of like the look of these plain ones more, so I might get these. So, I got um, this pair of Birkenstocks, and I'm really happy because now I have like another option to wear to the beach, and they're also really comfortable too. All right, we're back in the hotel now, and we're all a little bit tired from having to get up so early for the hike this morning. So I think we're just gonna stay in the hotel room for a little bit and chill, and then we'll have a think about dinner. So we decided to try Duke's Waikiki for dinner tonight. It's a really popular place here and we thought we'd finally give it a try because we haven't tried it before. So hopefully it's nice. It's very loud in here so sorry if you can't hear me that well. But I think I'm going to get the calamari in these ribs as well. They're both like entrees so I thought I'd just have both of them and that's basically like a meal. Sounds nice. arrived. I'm really excited to eat. Um, I wasn't actually expecting this portions to be so big for my little appetizers, but anyway, here are the ribs and these are the calamari. I'm sure my family will probably have some as well, but my dad got chicken and then mum and James both got um, steak or something yesterday. Looks nice, but I'm really hungry, so I can't wait to eat. I'll try this calamari. Mm, that is so good. Try some rib. Not bad. It's a bit spicy. It's a bit spicy. Well, that was really nice. I definitely enjoyed it. The ribs are a little bit spicy, but I powered through it. Anyway, and the calamari was really nice too, but I ended up sharing that with the family because I did get a little bit full. And then I want to have a drink mashed potato in it. So I'm a little bit like, mm, I don't really want to drink from it, but I'm really thirsty and it was really spicy too. Anyway, um, everyone's done now and I am a little bit full, but I do still have a little bit of room for some dessert. So I'm currently standing in line to get shave ice because I've been wanting it this entire trip, but I've either been too full to get it after dinner or uh, I've missed out like their clothes and stuff. I was really disappointed. I went like the other night and I'm closed and I'm like, ah. Anyway, um, I'm finally getting it tonight though, but it's a bit of a long line, so we're gonna be waiting for a little while. I'm not complaining, I had a lot of dinner. Anyway, let's try some. Oh, by the way, they've got like the tropical island one, so it's like mango and pineapple, condensed milk, and these little popping pills, which I love. Anyway, I'll stop talking and I'll try some. That is so refreshing. That is so good. 
I'm supposed to be sharing this with my family. I don't think they're gonna get much though. Mm, so good. So I thought that I would walk off all that food I just had and go for a little walk um, with my mom on the beach. Um, it's actually like, it's, I love walking um, on the beach at night time. It's really like relaxing. I don't know if you guys can see, the water's really dark, but I mean, it looks really nice. If I wasn't wearing such a nice dress, I'd probably like to actually sit on the sand and watch the waves for a bit. Um, but yeah, I don't wanna ruin my dress. There are actually some people who are swimming, which I can't believe they're swimming. It's kind of a bit dark as well. A bit scary, but anyway. <laughs> Probably just go for a little walk then go back to our room. Alright, I'm in my PJs now and I'm definitely ready for bed. It has been such, I didn't even realize how much I've done today, but I am so tired and definitely ready to go to sleep. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Don't forget to check out my Instagram at Grace's World Official and I'll see you guys next time on Grace's Room. Bye for now. Bye.